Star Concerts. 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 I'm hailing, 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 I'm My name's Andrew Weatherall. Stoke Concerts. We find ourselves back at the previously investigated, highly exclusive venue steeped in history. With over 40 rooms to tackle, will we finally be able to work out who the negative dark energy is that follows the team? And will we be able to find out which entity it was that broke the stair banister on our last visit? With the very real possibility that someone will get lost amass the maze of stairs and corridors, will we all make it out in one piece? Stay tuned to find out. Just had a massive orb fly around your legs, Matt. Oh, so when I was leaning forward? Just as you sat back from leaning yeah. forward. Yeah. So I've just been filming this up to you now. It kind of danced around your legs. Okay, okay, no problem. If. Somebody yeah. moaning now? No, that was me. Oh, you do? Hmm. The lady that you're on about, her name's Ellen. Either Helen or Ellen. That's some sort of sounding name. Hi. Hi. Hi, it's me again. Um, we're just going to set up an experiment um, which involves a pendulum. And I know that people have reservations about pendulums that when people hold them, that they could be moving them either voluntarily or involuntarily. So, what we've got is we've got a pendulum that's suspended from an independent source, which we're going to use as a tripod. If you want to just pan around to the. There we go. Um, cool. 
We've got a, a, a candle under the pendulum that, that sort of serves as, as two purposes. One, to give it a little more energy for spirit to interact with. There's a long history that candles and spirits go together hand in hand. Um, also, it's to light up the, the crystal a little more so you can see it when we're filming it. We'll probably film it in night shot anyway so that you'll get a little more noticeable if the pendulum starts moving, which is good. So I'm hoping that we'll get some movement from the pendulum. Um, in this room, spirit have been wanting to come forward but have been quite reluctant. So I'm hoping that some kind of divination experiment will produce some results. So stay tuned folks and I hope you enjoy the vigil. Thanks. We're in the next Can you make yourself appear in that TV? Now. We're just doing some crawling out. Yeah, this room's not very nice. It's sort of rotting and um, really run down. There's a television um, just down the bottom there. We've just got set Can you show yourself on? So, the television's around. Show you anything. Try all your energies. What we're doing is leaving us here and seeing if it moves when we're not with it because we just had a few wolves flying in for over the old jet wall and we're calling out. So we're going to leave this be. I'm not sure if we're going to go out or off. And we'll come back in a few minutes and see if anything's changed in here because we're all moving together. Have we got just a second? There's no drawing on there apart from what I've just done. No, there's a couple of footprints, but let's see if, see if anybody draws anything. It's gone up by two degrees. Due to the nature of this automatic writing session, we had to cut it short for respect of the deceased person's family. At times it was brutal, graphic, but we felt we wanted to show this part. We were given dates and messages of a very sensitive nature relating to the work our team are doing to progress our knowledge in the paranormal field. We were told soon our team would be awarded with a gift from the spirit world. We have no idea what this would be, but it would make us stand out for what we believe in. Stoke Haunted, as a paranormal group, are moving forward and with the help of the spirit, we were given the thumbs up. Top, right or left, for yes. Bottom, right or left, for no. 18, 17, you are 17, correct? And you're a male. A. Adam, 
we've had quite a few people come through when we've been trying to contact spirits and they keep showing us a triangle. Has a triangle got something to do with leak? The area of leak? Mm, yes. Is it like a symbol? Is it some kind of symbol? Warning. It's a warning symbol. Is it a warning for our team? It's just a warning in general. Yeah. With all answers. Look for the truth. Don't touch. Do you want to step away now so Matt can do his job and send you to the light? Okay, if there are any spirits here to, that wish to communicate with us, could you move the glass in any direction, please, just so we know you're here? Okay. Thank you very much. Um, if you have a person you would rather use to speak on the table, could you point to that person now, please? That'd be you, Paddy. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. Are you male? Please go to Sarah on the left for yes, or Matt on the right for no. Thank you. I'll ask you your name, please. I'll start with the alphabet. Can your we go first name. name that I got before? Yeah, for us we talk. Yeah. Okay. Is your name Mr. Arthur? Okay. Yeah, you've got the Thank, you. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's see what we can pick up. See you Manage the building. 
Did you manage the building when it was a court? That wasn't a clear answer, I'm afraid. Yes or no, please. Or if you're running out of energy, a clockwise circle until you need to build, that's fine. a while to speak to someone. I understand. Do you feel trapped here? Mr. Arthur, are you still with us? Are you a spirit that's known to us? Are you a spirit that's communicated with us before? Are you a spirit that's communicated with us before? Spirit that's communicated with the people. Thank you for that. Do you have a message for us? Could you move to the yes cursor just to test that you can, please? Right, we're just going back into the pink room um, to check the trigger object, which is the globe on the floor, to see if we've had any movement. No. No, left them on. Okay. Still on exactly the same plan. Has it moved from Who left that pencil there? Me. Oh, he's standing there for a night with. I Africa's still on the top and it's still within the marked areas. Yeah, we marked. I don't know if you can see on the yeah, top. I left the pencil there because I still have marked the pencil the there. <coughs> it's not moved at all. It feels warmer in here. It feels colder in here. Colder. Are we leaving it or are we trying to take it, it with you? Because you've come back up with yeah. it. Because we've more weight to the bottom. Shall we turn the lights as we go then? Yeah. Hi there, it's me again. Um, I've just come, come in from the investigation and just want to share with you a few thoughts about how it's gone tonight, what we were expecting, etc. Um, it's been a good night. It's been a bit slow to begin with. Uh, there was a few bits and bobs upstairs when we were doing a walk around. We had a bit of activity, some bumps and bangs, and felt like we were being followed and some mysterious cold drafts, which set the tone. We were expecting a, a reasonable night, or even a, a very good night in terms of activity. Um, in terms of vigils, um, upstairs we got some interesting sounds on the EVP, so it would be good to go back and look at the footage to see what we picked up properly and analyse the sound in, in that respect. On camera we got a good few light anomalies as well, so from the vigils um, we're hopeful that when we go back and look at the footage it's going to be productive in terms of um, what we would call paranormal activity that we can present. Um, other than this, I am quite tired. Um, I, I thought by now it's... Ooh, 10 to 8 in the morning. Um, I thought I would be a lot more tired than I am. Um, but it's okay, because I'm, I'm going to get into bed and, and not really worry about how tired I am when I'm asleep anyway, so that's okay. 
Um, just thought with you guys, if you have any questions about how the evening went or what experiments we did, etc., um, by all means just ask, drop us a comment down there or a message up there as normal, as I always say. Um, other than this, I, I just want to say from uh, a mediumship perspective, it's been different for me tonight. I took a bit of a step back so I could um, get to grips with, with some equipment like the parabolic dish and how to record it, etc. Um, I didn't mind because I'd been there before and I, I kind of knew what to expect from the building. No real new spirit showed themselves other than in the automatic writing experiment. There was a, an unexpected moment there where a wandering spirit wanted some help. Um, other than this, uh, I wish you all a good day. Uh, it's good morning for me. It could be good night by the time you read this. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, wherever you are, have a good one. I'll see you later. Bye.